Hello everyone, welcome to SSC Mock. In this video, I will tell you how to start your preparation for SSC CGL 2026 from zero. Every year more than 5 lakhs plus repeaters and more than 10 lakhs plus newcomers appear for this examination. And they go through this same confusing points. What are these? They always struggle with proper planning. How can they cover the whole syllabus in 9 to 12 months and get selected. Then they struggle with the timing for each sub by when I should complete the syllabus or complete this particular subject. Which are the subject I should read daily? What are the right resources to follow whether YouTube videos, whether I should enroll in a class or which book I should buy or the notes I should follow and day to day time management. In this video, I will give you a very comprehensive plan in which I will give you 100% syllabus completion plan. Second, three phase revision plan with which you will be sure shot ready for selection. Third, free guidance program in SSE Monk official telegram channel. Before I start, if you are joining this channel for the first time, my name is Jyoti Prakash Mohanty. I have cleared and selected in all these examination in my very first attempt while being a working aspirant. And for the last one year, I have been teaching and sharing my own experience of getting selected in all these examination through this YouTube channel SSE Monk. So without wasting time, let's start guys. Before you start your preparation, you should have some fundamental rules or planning for your selection. Now what are these? First thing is that you should ensure that your basic syllabus completion is done by 2026. It should not be the case that you are planning to complete your syllabus by May or June or something is still there to be completed. If you are not completing your syllabus by Feb 2026, then you are prepared to fail. I know this sounds really harsh but this is the truth. Second, you should complete at least three times revision and how to do that starting from conceptualization till your time bound detailed revision. I will discuss each and every point in detail. And third, this means the number of tests you will be attempting on a regular basis starting from your preparation journey so that it will help you create a mindset for your examination and you will be actually 100% fearless for your examination. So now with these fundamental rules, let's start with the planning. See, first thing you need to ensure that you have a proper time slot. Now see, I know this time slot may or may not work for some students, but you need to fix something. Second thing, if you are a repeater or if you are a working aspirant, then do not worry, I will be providing a very comprehensive strategy for each one of you, those who are repeater and working aspirants in my upcoming videos. But till then, understand the fundamentals of clearing this examination and how you should prepare yourself. Now, first thing, you should divide your time slot into three parts. First, early morning, that is 6 to 9. Second, midday, 10 to 1. And third part, 4 to 6 pm. Now see, I am telling you this after guiding 1000 plus students and if you check SSMO official channel, this year within last 7 to 8 months, 17 plus students are already selected from SSMO family. Now you understand there is a neuroscience behind it when I tell you to read a certain things, a certain subject during this period of time. Now you need to ensure depending on your situation how you should plan your study but at least 8 hours of study is required if you are a full time aspirant. Second part. Now, most important thing, understand this, your exam will be by June and July of 2026, right? So, in June, July and in May, you should not focus on completing syllabus or watching random YouTube videos to learn certain things. From May till your examination, you should focus on these three things. First, Every day you are attempting a full mock test, you are analyzing this, then one day revision plan. That means every subject you take up for one day and you work on your weak areas through active recall and through pocket PDFs. Now, third, the most important part, till May June, you have almost attempted 50 plus mocks, right? And in those mocks, the questions in which you have made mistakes, you need to go through it or the question you skipped because this is the part 99% of the students miss and I am pretty sure you are also one of them. And if you have failed this, do comment 
whether you revised all the wrong question you attempted during your mock days or not now see why i am doing this reverse engineering you need to understand the one fact that when to complete the syllabus and when to start focusing on your revision and in your performance you can't do the whole syllabus thing till your end right so the next part is march to april in this particular phase you should focus on more pyqs solving all relevant types of pyqs attempting more chapter wise tests in sectional test this will ensure that whatever you have learned during your syllabus completion period you are applying those things and how you are performing in those things and that to be in a time bound manner second every two days you will assign to a particular subject and you will ensure that there is no weak areas in those particular subjects every week you will be only attempting two full mocks not more than that not exhaust yourself with tons of mocks because if you see this from may to july you will be approximately attempting 50 mocks over here march to april you will be attempting 10 plus mocks over here and prior to that you will be attempting certain number of mocks as well so do not exhaust yourself rather than exhausting yourself through mocks you should focus on the minute details and get better then the last but the most important part october to february see i know if you are planning for 2026 examination then you are going to appear in this year cgl right so you should not think anything you should go and appear in this year cgl have the experience then with that experience start your journey so as you all know by third week of september the exam will be over then from 1st october i think that would be the right time for all of you to start your preparation for cgl and to complete your syllabus by february 2026 now during this period from monday to friday you should only focus on subject wise syllabus completion from saturday to sunday you should focus on the notes if anything is missing or anything is left and clearing the backlogs if you are due to any certain reason health issue family issue any certain issues you could not complete something during monday to friday but that should be done during saturdays and sundays you should not push your backlogs towards the next week because if you start pushing backlogs it will become a mountain and you won't be able to cross it third weekly revision plans now what is weekly revision plans whatever you are learning or whatever sources you are following that particular source have certain questions or certain number of tests through that questions you can check whatever you learned during monday to friday and saturday to sunday how much percentage what is the percentage of amount you have actually absorbed and you know very well then fourth fortnightly revision tests you should attempt this fortnight revision test that will be provided for free through this ssc mock official channel through ssc mock and in which you will understand whatever you have learned in the last 15 days how you are performing actually in that particular thing so with this your whole preparation journey will be 100% complete and you will be 100% ready now why i am telling you this see when you will be moving through october to february you will see your score is somewhere around 100 100 plus or less than 100 and that is acceptable because you are learning you are in the baby steps now when you jump to march and april you will see by attempting pyqs chapter test sectional test your score will jump to 120 130 and when the devil will come from may june onwards if you follow this plan properly religiously you will see your score is jumping above 150 and this is my guarantee because you are seeing the result 17 plus students are already selected through this channel by applying these formulas now it's your turn see mission plan is simple you should have a daily schedule what to be done during that day then you should have some practice classes to understand how you are performing or you are analyzing different sets of questions third you should have a monthly analysis session to understand how you are performing how your competitors are performing and what needs to be done to get better in the upcoming months and for your daily doubts you should need something right and for all these four things i have planned something and what is that i have planned score improvement program this program will be completely free in my telegram channel ssc monk official in which you will be getting daily schedule in which i will plan practice classes for free in youtube channel i will be taking monthly analysis through telegram and youtube live sessions and there will be a specific doubt solving group 
to solve your daily doubts like some questions, some personal struggles will do that. And if you stick to this plan with 100% honesty, trust me, 2026 will be your last attempt and you are getting selected for sure. Are you guys ready? If you are ready, then comment. Let's start below this video and do not forget to subscribe to this channel. Share it with all your friends. All the very best guys. See you in the next video.